Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. The logo control and the image control both insert a selected image into your form. The only difference between the two controls is that the logo is automatically resized and then placed into the form header section within the form. When you use the image control, you get to choose the size and placement of the selected image within your form. To add a logo to your form, just click the logo button. In Access 2013 through 2010, this button is located in the header and footer button group on the design tab of the form design tools contextual tab within the ribbon. In Access 2007, this button is located in the controls button group on the design tab of the form design tools contextual tab within the ribbon. After you have clicked the logo button, Access will open the insert picture dialog box which you can use to locate the image file that you want to use as your logo within the form. Select the image file and then click the OK button in the insert picture dialog box to automatically insert the logo into the form header section of your current form. To insert an image into the form and also choose its placement and size, click the image button that appears in the controls button group on the design tab of the form design tools contextual tab within the ribbon. Next, click and drag over the area in the form or report over which you want to place the image. When you release the mouse button, the control will insert itself into the form and also launch the Insert Picture dialog box. Use the Insert Picture dialog box to locate the image file that you would like to insert. Select the image file and then click the OK button in the Insert Picture dialog box to insert the selected picture into the frame that you have created. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.